class, welcome back to our another English lesson for today. So, yesterday we started with a new unit, clean up. We have to always clean the house, clean the floor and everything. We have to clean up our toys. So yesterday we started doing places that can get dirty. So we had new vocab like floor, tiles, see if you can say it with me, table, carpet, bookcase, and ground. Very good. So let's see. Today we are going to study things we can use to clean them. So all that places that we can make dirty like the ground or the floor or the tiles, we have something to clean it with. That's what our new vocabulary words are going to be for today. So let's start off with our first one, which is pretty easy. I'm sure we all know it already. Mop. Everybody say mop. M O. Can you remember that's the short O word family? Mop. We use the mop to clean the floors. We make the mop wet and then you put it in a bucket, make it nice and wet, and then you sweep the floors with the Mop. I want everybody to practice saying it with me. Mop. Very good. Then we have our next one. Now listen carefully and repeat with me. Duster. Duster. You see, dust. Er. Duster. Can you say duster? And what is a duster? A duster will clean all of the dust like this. I'm sure mommy or daddy have one at home. You get all the places at the top with the duster. It gets rid of all the dust. Let's say duster. Very good. Then our next one we have, this is a long one, so listen carefully. Vacuum cleaner. Again, vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner. Now, what is a vacuum cleaner? A vacuum cleaner sometimes look like this, but some people have big ones or small ones, but they are always noisy. They make a lot of noise, but they suck up all of the dirt. Vacuum cleaner. Very good. Now let's see our next one. Our next one, our next few actually, is very easy. We have cloth. Look at my teeth at the end. Cloth. Cloth, the TH may cloth. Can you say cloth? And what is a cloth? It is almost like a rag. We use it to clean the tables, to wipe it down, make it a little bit wet, use a little bit of soap, then we clean off the tables. Cloth. Very good. Let's get to our next few. Our next one is rake. Easy to say. Rake. Rake. Now what is a rake? A rake looks like this. And we use the rake to clean up all the leaves in the ground outside. You know all the trees, leaves fell? We use the rake 
to bring the leaves closer together so we can put it in a trash bag and throw it away. Rake. Very good. Then we have broom. I'm pretty sure most of you know what a broom is already. Broom. We always have a broom inside of our classroom. Broom. So a broom is what we use to sweep the floors. You must use a broom first to sweep the floor before you use the mop. Because the mop is going to make everything wet. So you have to clean it first, sweep, sweep, sweep with the broom, and then use the mop. Oh, well, here we have broom. Okay, and then we have one more. Yesterday, one of our words, one of the vocabulary words was, was teeth. Places that can get dirty. Teeth. So we can use what to clean our teeth? A toothbrush. Toothbrush. Very good. Okay, class, these are our new vocabulary words for today that you are going to have to practice. If you cannot see the words clearly because of the light, don't worry, I will send you pictures as soon as the video goes out. Uh, please be sure to practice these vocabulary words and wait for your activity video to come. Thank you very much.